Hey guys, Axel Fireflurry here, here to bring you sort of a an interesting vlog, and I apologize if you hear any strange noises. Like this is just a notice. Um, I have my cat Sumtum on my lap right now, and he's a little needy. So a little bit about that before I get into the main part of the video. Um, we had two other cats before, and back in 2015. Uh, what was actually my cat had passed away, and last year, uh, sometimes brother had passed away, and sometimes the cat had, the one that's on my lap has never really been alone, has never really been the only cat, so since the other two passed away, he's been really needy for attention. And, because I love animals, um, he's sitting on my lap and he tends to meow if I don't really pay attention to him So if you hear meowing, please ignore it and I apologize, but on to the main part of the video so I've been going through some of the comments in some of my YouTube videos and Some people seem to have the wrong on wrong idea on What my YouTube channel is to me? My YouTube channel is just one of my many, many passions. I'm a costume, I'm a high-end costumer, where I make you a costume, you're looking at spending about seven to eight hundred dollars for like a low-end costume. And that takes a lot of time. I train rescue animals animals that have been rescued from really bad situations to be service animals and therapy animals. That also takes a lot of time. It's I do photography and now that the weather's warmer I'm outdoors a lot more taking pictures. I live in Utah and we tend to have a really high cosplay ratio like a lot of people who cosplay here in Utah and a lot of them want to become models and They ask me to take pictures of them and that takes about four or five hours out of my day to take pictures and then several hours editing the photos and I take care of my surrogate grandmother who's 75 and Lives by herself. I make sure that she's taken care of that takes up a lot of time. I have friends who don't really play video games, so we'll go out and we'll go see a movie, we'll go on a hike or something. That takes up a lot of time. I'm going back to school in two weeks. That's gonna take up a lot of time. And the reason I'm telling you this is because this is why my videos aren't super high in quality. Yes, I have the finances to get better equipment, but the reason I don't is because why am I gonna go out and spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars for something I don't do regularly? And I'm not saying I'm not passionate about YouTube and about content creating, I like making videos. I like when I'm in the mood to make them and I hope you enjoy them too. I'm actually not out to make a big name for myself. I'm not out to make hundreds of thousands of subs and make this my job. The reason I don't do that, again, is because I not only have other hobbies and other interests to occupy my time, but the fact of the matter is YouTube content creating to get big and actually make a livable profit is really really hard and it's a harsh truth but no matter how good you are there are hundreds of thousands of people on YouTube who are doing the exact same thing you are and if you want to make a name for yourself you have to do something better than them or you have to do something that makes you stand out a little bit more than the other thousand people who are doing the exact same thing you do. For example, I make ma a majority of Pokemon videos. You have PokeMMD, Shofu, uh, the Jaywits, 
you have yellow box bgc you have wolf glick you have i think i said cybertron vgc but i'm not cybertron vgc you have gator you have thunder blunder you have verlicify you have turret mob so that's like several people just right off the bat that i can think of and i know there are more pokemon content creators i on occasion make anime music videos there are several people who do that and it's not it's just not profitable i'm sorry especially with the whole copyright funness that's there so I'm being realistic with myself. If this is your passion, if this is what you want to do, I'm not telling you to give up. No. If this is something you're passionate about, do the best you can. Go as far as you can and keep pushing. For me, this isn't my calling. This isn't what I want to do. So I'm not going to go out and spend hundreds of thousands of dollars on equipment again that I just will not use. And... That's really it. My videos are because it's a subject I'm passionate about for one reason or another, and I'm feeling that passion. That's why I upload the video, and miraculously, I'll have time. But um, another video, I mean, another problem I see people having with my channel is my thoughts don't come across clearly and i openly admit that yes my thoughts don't always come out clearly it does get a little messed up it does get a little jumbled and it does get a little confusing and the reason why is personal preference i just do not like scripts i'm sorry i know they're helpful to keep your thoughts in order and to make the video seem it, it just doesn't even seem it makes the video more professional and it just makes it look better me i don't like it it just makes me sound a bit more robotic i when i talk i like to feel like i'm an emotional based speaker where it's just from head mouth to microphone to you guys to me it just seems more genuine that way and it just seems more human instead of hey guys Axel Fire Flurry here. Today we're going to talk about VGC 2017 rules and bans. To me, that just doesn't sound. It, to me, it just doesn't sound as entertaining. And it's probably on me. And I probably should start scripting a bit more. I mean, to an extent, I'll script a little bit to just say, okay, here are the points I want to cover and here's the order I want to do it in. But that's really about it. And another thing about my videos are like why they're just not so great or whatever you want to call them is I actually prefer working with other people. And I, I don't want that to sound like, oh, I need these other people in order to make my content good. No, that is not the case. I prefer working with other people. Uh, YouTube is pretty much the one place I go to talk about Pokemon. It's one of my passions. I love Pokemon. I love playing casually. I love playing it competitively. Yes, you can do both. And this is just my place to go. And I have tons of other friends, but they don't really play Pokemon. So that's why I like the idea of doing collabs with people. That's why I want to do collabs with you guys. You guys can even pick the subject. Hit me up. We'll make a video for your channel, for my channel, for everyone's channel. Because I love talking Pokemon. And I want to talk about Pokemon with you guys. If there's a different video or a different subject you want to talk about with, with me, leave it in the comments section. I just love talking to people. I love the interaction. I only have one request please keep it civil the reason i say this is because i like talking with people and i like getting various opinions i like to see the broad spectrum of the thing and not just this one narrow mindset this one way of thinking i like to see everybody's way of thinking and then make my own opinion at the end of it based off of you know other people's opinions and the evidence 
laid in front of me. And that's pretty much it for for why my channel is the way it is. I'm going to keep uploading videos, don't worry guys, it's just not going to be like two videos every day or a video every other day. I just have other hobbies, other interests that just take up more time and actually pay better. Like with my photography, I'll go home and have like $300 for like an hour's worth of shooting and then I have to go home and do the editing and then I have to go and make sure my grandma's okay and I have to come home and start sewing a costume for a convention that's two weeks away so I try to upload as often as I can but I can't promise you that it's going to be all the time for my fans who are here thank you so much for your loyalty because I know my videos are not top quality and I Thank you for everyone who likes and subscribes to me because clearly I'm doing something. I am thankful for my 71 fans. To me, that's a high number and it's more than I deserve. And thank you guys. I want to talk with you guys. I want to work with you guys. I want to I want to meet you people. Be my friends. Be my fam. But guys, thank you so much. I will be making another really important video in just a few minutes so you will be getting a double upload today congratulations and i will see you guys in just a few minutes bye guys